Hello everybody. Today I'm using the Parazzo, or Parazzo, Parazzo I'm not sure <laughs> the right way to say it, Parazzo. Uh, this is their um, Wood and Spice. And I won this set uh, from Instagram from Parazzo themselves, so uh, this was provided by them. And I have on the pre-shave cream. I'm using the shaving cream and then I'll be following it up with their shave balm. So even though I won this as a part of a contest, uh, I'd still like to thank them for uh, making that offer. And uh, yeah, I'm really looking forward to, uh, to trying this out. So let's go ahead and get started. Wanted to cut in with a quick top-down view of lathering this, uh, this cream. Here you can see I'm just taking my time and uh, trying to make it as creamy as possible. Adding some water, whipping it up, adding a little more water. Just trying to be, take my time with it. And you can see I ended up with a really nice, dense lather. And uh, yeah, good stuff, as usual with Parasso. I've uh, already whipped up the lather. I used the Yachi 22 millimeter. This is their ever, ever helpful instead of ever ready. I think is that's the play on the words there. Very cute little little brush. A uh, little smaller than I usually use, but it does a really good job. All right, get a little bit of extra water on the face here. All right. So this whipped up into a very nice creamy lather. No complaints about that. It has a very, very nice fragrance to it. Uh, it does have some hints of the of the red, uh, which is their sandalwood. But it definitely, it has a different character than that. The spiciness definitely adds a different character. Um, and I had my choice whenever I won of any of the different sets and I've tried everything except for blue and uh, and this so I decided to go for this. Alright today I'm going to be using my Supply Pro, the SE Pro. I'm going to start out on five and uh, go from there. Let's see how that goes. And in here I have a supply black label blade. Which has fast become my favorite uh, inject blade. It is a very, uh, very smooth, very sharp. And I've used, <laughs> I've used them in just about every injector I have. I did have to um, I did have to take them out of the plastic injector in order to use them in my vintage razors. So um, I'm actually going to make a video about that because some folks that weren't aware, uh, it's pretty easy to take them out and then put them into a metal injector if you have one. Um, so I'm going to make a quick video on that just to show what that looks like, how to do that. So that folks, because uh, the, the reason for that is the plastic injector that they come in, the key is not as stiff as, uh, as a metal key, and it uh, has a hard time pushing apart the, uh, you know, the way injectors work is, especially the vintage, uh, is they're essentially bent together so that the two plates of metal are touching and where the blade, uh, in order to push the blade in, the key opens, sort of inserts and pushes those two apart. And um, some of the vintage ones are particularly stiff and really need that metal key. So um, I was able to use the plastic key to get it into my Schic M1 adjustable, but uh, all of the other ones, like my E and 
Elbow and all the others, I had to, I had to do the uh, the metal key. So anyway, I'll do a video on that. All right. Um, let's see. You know what? I'll go down to four on this. Yeah. All right. I will do four for the past two. All right. Across the green. Hope everybody's doing well today out there in Shave Land. I'm doing just fine. It's a bit of a lazy Sunday for me, but uh, having a nice day. And uh, been been waiting for this shave, but I got the uh, the Parasso gear in last week, maybe almost two weeks ago, and I was waiting for these Yachi brushes brushes to show up. Um, <laughs> when you order from China, sometimes it can be a real sort of you know, waiting game to uh, to receive things. So uh, this took these brushes took six weeks i think <laughs> so it happens it's okay it's worth the wait especially since they were so inexpensive uh i got a different one that was seven dollars and this one was i believe 12 12 or 13 something like that so uh, really well made uh worth the wait but <laughs> you look at the tracking and it I don't know, maybe someone else can make sense of it, but to me, <laughs> it's all very confusing. Um, anyway, they're here now. <laughs> That's all that matters. Okay. Let's go against the green. And yeah, I guess I'll go down to three on this. Little bit of touch up. All right, let's try here. Yeah, not bad. And I'm gonna crank it all the way up to do my touch up. Make sure that's at one six. It's the uh, the one consistent complaint that I see from folks about this razor is, especially if you get the black one, the numbers are so hard to see on that dial. Uh, so <laughs> just it takes. Take some young eyes or, I don't know, not my eyes. <laughs> I'm just gonna go ahead and do all this. It's really just a little bit, but you know, about my neck there, I was bleeding. Yep, about my neck. I thought I was being gentle, but I guess not. All the way up on six. 
nice bit of blade there. Yeah, that's good. Clean it right up. My neck's already kind of, I guess, nicked up a little, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna forgo doing any more on there. All right, we'll go ahead and rinse and see what the Alan has to tell me. irritation on the on my neck I don't know what I've I've only shaved with this razor it's my fourth time I don't know maybe <laughs> maybe having it up so high was, wasn't a great idea so maybe next time I will be on three three or four to start it's not too bad. Just a little bit of irritation. So I get to finish out with this nice bottle of uh, balm here. It is pretty, pretty liquidy. That's okay. That feels nice. Very nice. Probably used about <laughs> five times as much as I as I needed. It came out a little bit faster than I was expecting, but that's okay. Didn't waste too much. All right, let's kind of dab that off a little. Okay, that is very pleasant, I have to say. Very, very nice set. Uh, yeah, very nice fragrance. Uh, good performance. The uh, lather, you know, has not dissipated. It's still very thick, uh, very creamy, very hydrated. Very, very nice. Uh, so yeah, I've really enjoyed that. Uh, maybe next time a little more cautious with the razor, a little less. Uh, <laughs> a little less bravado would, would be wise. So, yeah, there we go. Great shave. I really enjoyed the products. Again, Proasso had the pre shave, shave cream, and after shave balm. My thanks again to Proasso for providing those and to you for watching. I really appreciate your time. Please leave a comment below you got anything to share with me i'd love to hear from you just say hi or anything else you got and uh till then till next time this is eric saying have a wonderful day happy shaves see you again soon all right bye-bye